Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. First and foremost, I just want to say that I hope you are all staying safe and healthy amid this COVID-19 crisis. Wow, it's such a crazy time and my heart goes out to everyone affected. I hope for those of us who are healthy that we're making the conscious decision to stay home to protect those most vulnerable and that if you are actually sick and showing symptoms, I really pray that you get well soon. So, I'm not a fashion YouTuber, but as you see from time to time, I do some fashion related videos on my channel because that's what I'm genuinely interested in. One of the things I've been obsessed with forever, fashion wise, is the cami silk top trend, you know, that's been here for I think like a couple years now. I first saw it on Emily Ratajkowski, she was wearing one from Reformation and that's when I'm like, okay, I gotta either get that one or find a dupe. I didn't end up getting the Reformation one only because it was actually sold out so I couldn't find it. So I found a dupe and I'm wearing it right now and I've had this for a couple years now. It's from Aritzia from their brand Babaton. Please correct me if I'm saying it wrong. So I found this dupe for a great price. It was like $30 and I've had it ever since. It's one of those items where it's easy to fall in love with but you don't know how to wear it. I've worn it a couple times in the way that Emily Ratajkowski has worn it but then I really... You you wear that outfit and then you kind of don't like repeat it again like for a while do you know what I mean so yeah so I don't I in a way I'm making this video for me because I just want to find new ways that I can wear this top sometimes I get stuck so yeah I went on Zara Zara is like a good authority on like how to wear something right now you know what I mean 2020 like look fashionable look cool look put together the point for me is definitely to wear it in a modern way to wear it in 2020 you know not how like it was styled last year or the year before you can have a wardrobe that is timeless but styling it in a way that's current is everything these work great i think with all the outfits strappy flat sandals that i got from target last year I also have my Forever 21 slip dress. I really love this, how versatile this is, and I actually have never worn it as a top until this video, but these are things you learn as you go along. Before I get into the looks, I just wanted to show you guys what this slip dress looks like on. I love the high slit. I, I love everything about this dress. If you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen me post this on my birthday. I actually wore it with a turtleneck, so great piece. All right, so for the first outfit, I tried faking this wide leg pant look. <laughs> I don't own a pair of jeans this wide, so this was the best I can do. Um, this is just a pair of straight leg jeans that I got from PacSun. But yeah, I think it looks cool. Um, honestly, the, the kind of wow factor for me is taken away only, I think, because I don't have jeans this wide. But otherwise, this is a great use of just wearing a black tank and jeans, so foolproof. So next, I'm going to take out some of the dress and try to do the untucked cami look. And yeah, again, um, you guys let me know. I'm not really feeling the look. I Honestly, I'm not really a black and light denim wearer in general, so this would not really be my go-to outfit. But again, I think it looks cooler with wider jeans, which I don't have. But yeah, it's an idea. Let me know what you think. Next, oh, I love this outfit so much. I'm so glad I went on Zara's site to style, to find this picture because I really wouldn't have thought of this. I love the all black look. All black makes it look so cool anyway. I can see this easily being like the coolest nighttime look. And I just love the, the different textures of the satin top with the faux leather pant. It looks so good. I just, I love everything about this outfit. Let me know what you guys think. And then, of course, you can try wearing it untucked. Again, let's see how it goes. Yeah, I think it's because this is not a real cami top and it's a dress. I think it's clinging to my body a little too much. So some of that coolness that uh, from the Zara picture is kind of taken away because it's not wide enough. Do you know what I mean? Like it needs to be more slouchy, definitely. And it's, it's, it's too body con right now. But yeah, let me know what you think. And then I switched cami tops to the one I was wearing earlier. I, I think this is great. 
I think honestly any color cami top would look good with the faux leather pants, but I easily see this look as being like a daytime look that can easily transition to nighttime. And I see myself like wearing this to even a meeting, like a business meeting with put on a blazer and cool shoes and you easily look like professional, which I think is cool. And then of course you can wear it untucked. Yeah, not, not sure. I mean, this actually is a cami top and it is looser fitting. But yeah, I guess on me, it just doesn't look that rock and roll. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I think it's just, it's, I don't know. It's hard to make faux leather pants look casual anyway, in my opinion. But this look is totally casual. And this is like the PJ look. And I actually would totally wear this out after a stretch. And yeah, I, I think I just like how this works because everything is just wide and flowy. Yeah, like in order for me to want to wear it untucked, everything just has to be wide. You know what I mean? So you're automatically just going for the all slouch look. You know what I mean? So yeah, I really love this. And I'm obviously illustrating it with a uh, lighter colored look only because I don't have an all black set. So yeah. Personally, I feel like I love the tucked in look. I think that looks great. And especially if you put a jacket on top, it looks so chic and effortless and stuff kind of digging the loose not tuck in vibe you know what i mean like i just think it looks really trendy and on point for 2020 especially you know so i gotta work on that myself to just be comfortable like not wearing it tucked in 90s minimalist grunge style is kind of like really in like this last year and this year so yeah i'm excited to like just try to wear it in that way you know it's so simple it's almost too simple to the fact that like, we still don't even know what to do. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, it's so simple just to throw on this top and to just throw on your pair of pants and go out the door, you know? But I feel like we're still all scared to do that. I feel like I've had this top and I'm just like, when it's time to get dressed, I'm like, um, guess I'm gonna put on some workout pants and sneakers and head out the door. You know, when it's just as easy to throw this on and throw these pair of pants on, you know, and head out the door. So I wonder what it is just about fashion in general, like that makes like normal people like me and you scared, you know, to try things. Like I just envy those YouTubers and Instagram like girls who just look so put together all the time. Especially, you know, when they're just going to the grocery store, just like running errands and stuff. I'm like, wow, I went to the post office, but I literally wore my uh, jacket and workout pants that I always wear. And also, if you're wondering, like, I'm actually not wearing a bra with both these tops. I personally don't have a strapless bra only because I haven't been able to find a really good one that will lay completely seamless and also stay up without me having to like hike it up all the time. So instead I have these nipples skin. I love these so much. I've had these for a few years now. I got it on Amazon. They were recommended by Jen Im, um, the Korean YouTuber, no Korean American YouTuber. <laughs> I'll link them in the description box, but they are literally lifesaver. They look like these and they just, they're silicone and you just slip them on and you can wash them and reuse them. Like I've had the same, I have two of these, like two boxes of these, and I've been using them interchangeably for a couple years now and haven't replaced them. So they're good. As long as you put them away in the thing that it comes in, you know, like when you're done with it and don't like leave it hanging around, they should last you a while. So yeah. So this is my secret for anything now that like if I wear a tube top or if I wear like, you know, a cami top like this because for the most part, having bra straps aren't cute, you know? I mean, I could wear my nude bra with this and it will be okay, you know? But for the most part, I just, I like a seamless look, you know what I mean? I just, I don't know, it's that I just don't wanna wear a bra. <laughs> but I also don't want my nipples to be, you know, out either. But yeah, like what I like about these is that, you know, like obviously I have no shape, but it is, it does kind of round them so that like, it still looks like I'm not completely flat or anything, you know what I mean? And I mean, mm -hmm. I do, like, I'm not real, like, I'm a 32B in bras, so, like, I don't have much boob anyway, but it, it, it helps to, like, lift them up a teeny bit and, like, not take away what I have, you know what I mean? Otherwise, like, yeah, a bra would be the most ideal because then you can get your full shape and, you know, and, like, you know, like, look nice. But, like, for me, I'm just lazy about that anyway. I just like to have a no um, bra strap kind of look. 
Um, but who knows, like, so, so, it depends on how I feel. I might wear a bra with this, but for the most part, I have these, so I probably won't. When it gets warmer, I definitely want to be wearing this top out. But in the meantime, we can just uh, plan what we're going to wear, because obviously we're not going anywhere. <laughs> but you can wear this at home, too. I mean, like, I'm wearing this at home now, and I'm like, just look nice at home, you know? Like, practice wearing what you like at home, so then when we get the opportunity to go out again, sometime in the future, hopefully soon, then, like, we'll feel confident in, like, what we're wearing, you know what I mean? So yeah, that's my little pep talk. But yeah, you guys, I hope you like this video. Like and subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you in my next video.